As I stood in front of the mirror, a mix of confusion and anxiety swept over me. I had never imagined myself in this situation before. The four outfits laid out on my bed were far from anything I'd ever wear, let alone consider. Frilly dresses and high heels stared back at me, as if daring me to make a choice. It all started when my eccentric aunt, who had always been one to push the boundaries of convention, invited me to a mysterious event. She promised it would be an unforgettable experience, one that would challenge my perception of the world. Intrigued, I accepted her invitation, unaware of what was in store. Upon arriving at her extravagant mansion, I was greeted by a room filled with laughter and conversation. As the night progressed, I noticed an unusual excitement in the air. It was then that Aunt Penelope made her grand announcement, a unique fashion challenge. Each guest was to pick an outfit from four options, and wear it for the remainder of the evening. My heart raced as I examined the choices. There they were, four frilly dresses, each more elaborate than the last, accompanied by equally elaborate high heels. My mind was a whirlwind of thoughts. I was torn between conforming to the expectations of the event and preserving my own sense of identity. Aunt Penelope approached me with a knowing smile, her eyes twinkling with mischief. Alex, dear, I've seen you face challenges head on your entire life. This is just another adventure, an opportunity to break free from the confines of comfort. Her words resonated with me. I took a deep breath and selected a pink dress, with intricate lace patterns and delicate ruffles. The high heels were a shimmering silver, surprisingly elegant. As I slipped into the outfit, a strange transformation began to take place. It wasn't just the clothes, it was as if a newfound confidence was seeping into my very being. I stood taller, shoulders squared, a sense of empowerment coursing through me. Stepping into the event, I received a mix of reactions. Some people were taken aback, while others were genuinely intrigued by my choice. The evening unfolded in a whirlwind of conversations, laughter, and unexpected connections. I found myself shedding preconceived notions, embracing the unfamiliar, and embracing the freedom to express myself in ways I had never imagined. As the night wore on, I found myself immersed in a world of exhilaration and liberation that I had never experienced before. The swish of the dress around my legs and the click of the high heels against the floor became a rhythm that resonated with my newfound sense of confidence. It was as though I had shed layers of self-doubt and hesitation, stepping into a version of myself that had been waiting to emerge. People around me began to see past the outward appearance and instead engaged with the person I was becoming. Conversations flowed more freely, laughter came naturally, and I discovered an unexpected ease in connecting with others. I realized that wearing the girlish outfit wasn't just a costume, but a catalyst that had broken down the walls I had unknowingly built around myself. A group of people, some of whom I had only just met, enthusiastically invited me to join them in the center of the dance floor. Without hesitation, I accepted. As I twirled and moved to the music, the dress floated around me like a vibrant swirl of color, and I felt an overwhelming sense of freedom. All traces of self-consciousness melted away, replaced by an exhilarating joy that emanated from deep within. Surprisingly, the high heels that I had initially found intimidating became an extension of my movements. They added a touch of grace and elegance, allowing me to glide across the floor as if I had been wearing them all my life. In those moments, I was no longer bound by societal norms or expectations. I was simply me, fully embracing the experience and radiating a contagious energy that drew others in. As the night drew to a close, I couldn't help but reflect on the transformative journey I had undertaken. The frilly dress and high heels had become symbols of my willingness to embrace the unknown, challenge my own biases, and discover the beauty in breaking free from the confines of gender stereotypes. I realized that true liberation wasn't just about the clothes I wore, but about the mindset and courage to be authentic in every moment. As I changed back into my usual attire, a sense of gratitude washed over me. I knew that this night would forever be etched in my memory as a testament to the power of stepping out of one's comfort zone. I left Aunt Penelope's event not only with fond memories and new friendships, but also with a renewed sense of self-assurance that I carried forward into every aspect of my life. 
And so, the night I wore a girlish outfit and danced in high heels became a cherished chapter in my journey of self-discovery, a reminder that embracing who we are, without fear of judgment, can lead to the most extraordinary and liberating experiences.